Hello everybody and welcome to my Boston College Eagles uh, dynasty here on NCAA Football 14. Um, I know this is such short notice and I haven't been uploading a lot of uh, videos on my channel, but um, uh, I really uh, I really wanted to do this. Um, um, it's the, like I said, the Boston College Eagles NCAA Football 14. Um, Dynasty, and I, uh, I didn't record week one, uh, sorry, we won that game, though, 27-17 to over the FCS East uh, Howlers, uh, and we are here in week two going up, up against the Wake Forest Demon Deacons, who are also 1-0, um, and uh, a, fr uh, um, a different YouTuber uh, inspired me to uh, to do this, his name was um, For and You, so if you want to check out his channel, he also did a Boston College um, Dynasty, but, um, every game I will be uploading the fourth quarter live, um, so that's where we are here in, uh, week two, uh, we are up 24 to 3, um, Wake Forest is driving, they have, they are, uh, at our 28, no, they're at, yeah, they're at our 28 yard line, uh, and it's third and one for them, and we've, uh, we've had some big plays on offense, but, uh, here we go, let's get right into it. Now, uh, third and one for Wake Forest. Can they convert? Read option. Hines going to keep it, and he's going to get the first down on seven yards. And uh, they've been going with the hurry-up offense all day here in this one. Uh, this is now first and ten again for Wake Forest. They have had lots of troubles on offense. Uh, haven't turned the ball over, but uh, here on the triple option, the pitch out to Yates. He's going to go, and yes, he will get in. A 21-yard touchdown run for the Demon Deacons. Their first touchdown of the night on the triple option. And that for sure got the Demon Deacons in for a touchdown. Extra point is up and good, and they are down by 14 now. Still need two touchdowns, but can they stop our very powerful running attack? Boston College offense is Harmon not going to take it from the back of the end, front of the end zone, excuse me, and he's only going to get 16 yards, but uh, here are some highlights of the game. Um, there was the major run. No, that wasn't the major run, um, but our uh, halfback, there it was. Big 58-yard touchdown run. That was the last score for us. Um, but now uh, 4.43 to go in this fourth quarter. Uh, can we keep the lead and take the win home with us? Is Smith on first and 10, going to get 10 yards. He's had a great day, 161 yards on 20 rush. And he's had two touchdowns as well, so very effect, very effective on the ground uh, is what uh, is what we uh, we've been today. First and ten now. Logan on the speed option, just gonna keep it. So we can drag down. It's gonna get four yards. Bring up second and six. One of the rare things we've done today is pass. Um, definitely have not passed. A lot at all today. Mainly been run is here on second and six. The counter counter run goes to Smith. We'll get two yards. Bring up third and four. Four BC. Can they convert? If they do, it will uh, of course extend the drive. Um, but we really don't want to give Wake Forest the ball back. As Logan drops back, looks to pass, and he will be hit as he throws, and it will force an incomplete pass. Bring up fourth and four, and this is the first punt of the day for us. As you can see, we've only passed the ball 12 times today uh, in this one. And the punt goes to Walker, who will take it and uh, get a pretty decent return, 14 yards. And uh, Cam Wake Forest perhaps come back and tie it. It, uh, it of course will be very difficult. They 
like I said earlier, they have not been at all too good today uh, on the on the uh, both the ground and air. But first and ten is Hines. Play action. Gonna keep it and throw to Walker, who's gonna get 13 yards in the reception. And that's another first down for the Demon Deacons. Shotgun formation. Hines looks to throw. And he will. Over to Clark. He's going to get only three yards. Three minutes left to go in this one. Can we keep the lead that we have had so long over this away team? This is the conference opener. As Hines looks, throws a deep bomb. And that's going to be deflected by Julius McMahon. It's now third and seven. They've only been two for six today on third down. This one, they need. Play action, Hines. Looking to throw, no fire over to Yates. He's going to get the 10-yard first down reception for Wake Forest, and that will extend their drive. Twenty-four to ten is your score. Hines looks to throw all day. Oh my goodness! Oh, and it'll be sacked in the backfield. One of the rare things we've seen today are sacks, and that one goes for a minus eight yards. Our defense been pretty good on the line. We've had a couple deflections and two or three sacks. Now second and a mile. Hines looks to throw again. All day again before firing out to Bryant, who's got open field before him, and he's got a 39 yard reception for the Demon Deacons. Big Force has actually been pretty good on the pass today. Now, only about two minutes to go. The pitch outside goes to Bryant, and he's going to sneak his way into the end zone. 11 yards on the touchdown run in this game has turned into something for the Demon Deacons as they were at one point down 3-24, to but they've now scored two touchdowns and have made it a touchdown point game with two minutes to go here in this one. Can we run this clock out and keep the lead that we have had all game? Kickoff goes to Hartman. He's going to take it. He's going to he's gonna go down the sideline. Could he make it? No, he won't get to the end zone. 44 yards, though, exactly to midfield. Great, great return. Uh, but he wasn't able to punch it in. Uh, that would have been the first touchdown, uh, kickoff touchdown return that I've had on this game, but I, uh, I haven't had one. As Smith now on first and 10. He was going to get cream in the backfield and like forced to be forced to call the uh, first of their three timeouts. If they can just stay strong on defense, they might be able to get the ball back. Second and 11. Logan pitches it outside to Smith. Smith with some room and he's going to get nine yards on the pitch. Outside to the left. Third and two. If we don't convert here, Wake Forest will get the ball back with very good time left on the clock. We've been pretty decent on third down today, but this one we need is Smith up the gut. He's going to get it, and that just might end it. We've nearly had 200 yards on the ground today. What a close game this game has turned into. Now Logan hands it off. To Smith and Smith gonna gonna bounce off the tackle and he's gonna get 12 yards on the carry. Another great carry by him. We've been 100% in the red zone today. Very good. Uh, gonna wanna chew down most of this clock. Uh, I formation. Logan gonna hand it off back to Smith, who's 
We're gonna get stopped. We're gonna get no yards. This game is coming to a close. And we might just be able to take the win with us and then become 2-0 on the season. Handoff goes to Smith. Who's going to bounce off a tackle? Oh my goodness! And he's going to get in the end zone! 17-yard touchdown run. And he just plowed through those defenders like they were nothing. And he's tripping over a... Tripping over a Wake Forest Demon Deacon who looks like he's injured. And he just, just fell down again. It's awfully strange, but... No. Nevertheless, a great touchdown run. For Smith. Kyle Smith, no doubt, the best player of this game. He bounced off like three tackles. And it's going to be extremely hard for Wake Forest to tie this up. Need two touchdowns with only 33 seconds to go. And we might just be able to take the win with us. No timeouts. We're probably going to come away with this one. Hines on first and ten. He's going to be sacked in the backfield. Loses seven yards and we've had at least... Four sacks on the day. Our defensive line all game has been just great. Second and a mile now. There's a spike. 17 seconds to go. We are up by two scores. Mike Forrest has been three for seven today on third down conversion. This one extremely far away. As Hines looks to throw, he's just going to screen it over to Bryant. He's going to be well short. The first down is you're just gonna get piled. Fourth and fourteen. That just might be the last play of the game. Hines with a Hail Mary, just gonna be batted down. Turnover on downs, it doesn't matter. We win. Second game in a row that we've won. Second game second game at home. And we win this one. Beating the Demon Deacons. Who looked like they might have had a chance. And Kyle Smith, 214 yards today, three total touchdowns. And this was a great college football matchup. Here on our home turf. That was great. Um, and yeah, week two has come. And gone. A great game. A great fight. And there are some stats. The only thing that Wake Forest did better than us was turnovers and passing yards, but we destroyed them in rushing in the rushing game. And we win! And we become two and O oh on the conference opener. And a great game. Over Wake Forest. Next week, we go for our first away game at USC, which, of course, will be a difficult game. Thank you all for watching. This game is at 832 seconds, or this uh, this video, excuse me. But, um, yeah, thank you all for watching week one, and I will see you all later.